Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to assemble this awesome 4-in-1 robot car. This is an Arduino compatible smart car designed for beginners. This kit comes with several leveled bags containing all the parts we'll need. Let's see the part first. Two acrylic chassis, four tires, four DC motors, input-output expansion board, L298N motor driver, line tracking module, ultrasonic sensor module, HC06 Bluetooth module, SG90 servo motor, IR remote, 18650 battery holders for two cells, 18650 battery charger, servo and ultrasonic holders, connections cable, screwdriver and allen key, screws and nuts for all parts. And the most important Arduino Uno. We have all the components of the smart bot car, so let's get started. Remove the protective film before assembling. First, we'll assemble the motors. For that, let's take the motors and open the four motor bags and lay out components. For each motor, we need one aluminum block and two M3 by 30 hexagon socket screws and two M3 nuts. Let's attach the motor to the aluminum block using these screws and nuts. Now we'll take our acrylic chassis and attach the motor assembles. We will use two M3 by 10 hexagon socket screws for each motor. Line up the motor with these holes in the white frame and secure them with the screws. Next is the L298N motor driver. We will need 4 M3 by 14 hexagon socket screws, 4 M3 nuts, and 4 separation shims. Pay attention to the direction of the motor driver when mounting it. The shims help prevent short circuits. Now let's install the line tracking module. Attach the tracker sensor to the front underside of the chassis. Now let's come to the upper chassis part. We'll install the brain of our car, the Arduino Uno R3, an expansion board. We will use 3 M3 by 14 screws, 3 separation shims, and 3 M3 nuts. Put the 3 separation shims on the chassis and mount the Uno. After that, place the expansion board onto the Uno. Now it's power time. Let's install the batteries and mount the holder securely. After mounting the cell holder, add two pieces of 18650 lithium batteries and connect to the expansion board power slot. Now for the ultrasonic sensor, let's take the SZ90 servo motor, servo holder and screw and nuts. Mount the servo motor like this way. After mount, connect the servo motor to the servo slot from the expansion board. Then the ultrasonic sensor module with its holder. We will use this tiny M1 by 6 screws for this.
Now time to connect everything we have. Connect ultrasonic sensor 4 pin cable. Some cables need to go through this hole in this chassis for clean cable management. Connect motors with this L298N motor driver. Follow the manual wiring diagram carefully. Connect motor drivers, 2 pin and 6 pin cables. Finally, connect line tracking modules, 5 pin cable. Now we will attach the top and bottom plates of our robot car for maximum stability. Install 6 M3 by 40 copper standoff on the lower plates. After that, carefully place the top chassis matching all cutouts. Secure with M3 by 10 screws. Almost done. Let's attach four tires using M3 by 25 cross screws. With this IR remote, we'll control our robot car. We need this Arduino cable for uploading the code. We'll connect Bluetooth module after uploading the code. And there we have it. Our robot car is fully assembled. We'll program and run it now. You'll find all the codes in the video description below. Let's connect the Uno with computer and upload the code. Make sure you include all the libraries necessary for this robot. Connect the Bluetooth module after uploading the code. Let's turn on this smart board car and test all four modes. First, we can control the movement of this car with this IR remote. If we press 2 in the remote, this robot car will turn to be obstacle avoiding car. If we press 1 in the remote, this robot will turn to be a line following car. Finally, to control the car by mobile, download Illigo Kids application. If you open the app, you will see it's nicely built in. Click on remote control option and connect the Bluetooth. After device connected successfully, we can control the robot car from mobile. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or suggestion, leave them in the comment section below. See you in the next video.